Yo YouTube, what's going on and welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. Uh, last episode we took on Runt and killed him. And this episode, I don't know what we're going to do. Uh, continuing along the quest line for sure, kind of want to take out some bandit camps. That's a possibility, of course. Uh, and we need to get on to these, these stealth quests as well, start working on them. So... Yeah. Uh, what's your quest say to do? Go to the Hall of the Upper Castle. Let's go ahead and get that done. My lord, I'm afraid you were right when you said these hostilities wouldn't end at Probislavitz. That comes as no surprise. What has happened? I men reported two more attacks today. <clears throat> Ah, Henry. I'm glad you're here. It seems like we'll have another task for you. Come and join us. My lord. Greetings, lad. The bandits raided a few remote hamlets, but that's the least of our worries. They also attacked Merhoyed, and that's a much more serious matter. Merhoyed? Matthias is working there. They attacked right after the battle in Provislavitz. Bastards are probably trying to prove they're still strong. But there's a silver lining. Villagers held them off, and they even took one captive. He's wounded, but we can still interrogate him. Your graces. I hope I'm not intruding. On the contrary, Master Tobias. Unlike Bernard, you are the bearer of good tidings. Or so I gather from the coin you carry. Tell me, how many Groshen did we find in Pribislavitz? My lord, I'm sorry, but my news is no better than Captain Bernard's. These coins are very good. Uh, that is to say, well-made facsimiles, as we call them. Uh, fac... what? I don't give a fac what you call them. I want to know what they're facking worth. Uh, that's just it, sir. They're worth nothing. Are you saying what I think you're saying, Master Tobias? Um... This here... Is just a pile of copper. Curva! Fuck! Plated with silver, so it's still of some worth. Mm. Curva! Fuck! Is it a lot of work to make such counterfeits, Master Tobias? I should say so, sir. Highly demanding work. Especially to make such plausible forgeries. They would need a well-hidden foundry, several craftsmen, and a source of material. But they could just be brought in from somewhere else, could they not? Well, they could, but then again, the silver mines are nearby, and these groschen seem freshly minted, so... So we are facing a foe who has almost limitless sources of coin. That's all we need. Doppeldell! Well, gentlemen, it's clear what we have to do. Interrogate that captive bandit, find out their numbers, and promptly cut off their supply of money. Otherwise, they'll soon have another encampment. If they haven't already. I doubt it, sir. Merhayed wouldn't have been able to hold them off if they did. Well, lad, I said it would have work for you, but it never crossed my mind there would be this much. You've already proved your worth as an investigator, so I'm putting my faith in you again. Go to Merhayed and question that captive. Find out where those brigands are hiding, how many there are, and what they're planning. And while you're at it, see if you can find some clues as to where this counterfeit coin is coming from. Very well, sir. Good luck. We're counting on you. All of us. Come report to me as soon as you know anything. I'll be at the lookout point near Talmberg. Looks like we get stopped What's by some bandits yeah. along the way. Yeah. Run over here, jump off the horse. <laughs> Get off my doggy bitch. That one's down. Get him, boy. That one's dead. Oh, there he is. Come 
Come on, you son of a bitch. That a boy. Get fucked. Get fucked. Mercy kill. Might as well. Alright, let's see what they got for loot. Need some food. I'm gonna take some stuff to repair too. Take your groschen, of course. And your gloves. Uh, anything worthwhile on you? Other than that? Doesn't look like it. It looks like we're cutting in. You know, game just saved out of nowhere. Yeah. As I say, it looks like we're going into a cutscene, but apparently not. The game just saved out of nowhere. Alright. Wait a second, what am I supposed to be doing here? Uh, interrogate the captive in Melhoryed. Find out what happened to Matthias. Okay. Well, where the hell is this captive at? Just shows a big area. Talk to her. Good day. What is it? All right, we have an objective to talk to Matthias now. Run over here, over here, I think, right? How? You're a sight for sore eyes. What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, Matthias. Sir Radzig sent me here to investigate the raid. Sir Radzig? Looks like you've come up in the world, mate. You're here as his envoy? Alright, so we talked to Matthias here, and he pretty much said... It sounds like we have two different people we could talk to, Melikar or Strahl. I think they're going to lead down different paths. I wanted to start the uh, village up, but I'm not seeing the quest to start it for some reason. I'm going to run over to Talmberg and talk to uh, whatever is Sir Divish. Is that his name? See if we can't start that quest line up. So I want to get the town started. I'll start getting us some money in. Yeah, it's showing up on, it's not showing up on the map, but it's showing up on the little mini bar up here to do this, the town. That's odd. All right, let's talk to him, get this town started. Greetings. What do you need? All right, we picked up the quest to start the village. We're going to go find his, uh, locator. So I think that's what we're going to do. I do want to get this village started. Sooner we get a starter, sooner we get stuff built, sooner we'll have income just flying in. That's what I want. Ambush. Right away for a second there, jump off the horse, get the sword out. Dog needs to go. Oh, we're getting fucked up because of that dog. You call that? 
Get no stamina because that damn dog. I'm gonna enjoy this. I'll gut you like a rabbit. Jesus, come on now. Got all of them. What a pain in the dick. Alright, here we are. Who are you? What? So, it's all clear to me now. What is? Who are you? You've no business here. I'm Henry, and I was expecting to find you here. What? How could you? Sir Divish's locator went missing around these parts. Well, it seems like he's all out of luck, don't it? Divish ought to have sent someone better than you to parley. He didn't send me to parley. He sent me to deal with it. Deal with it? There's plenty of us, and you're on your own. So I think twice about how you're going to deal with that. Uh... Let him go, right now. Otherwise, I'll... I'll, um... Uh... <laughs> You're pathetic. Get lost, laddie. Oh, we're attacking. Oh, well, I tried. We'll have to do things the hard way, then. At him, lads! Well, I never... The pig turns up willingly for the slot him. Twitching. Come here, Lily Liver. 
You'll pay for that. You're dead. Is that all you got? Switch off of that guy. Jesus Christ. What's the matter? Come on! Damn it. Come on, you bastard. Shit. The dog ran off. He got mad at us. He'll come back later. Hmm. Where they get him hiding at? There he is. Psst. I'm being held captive. Help. Thank you. My pleasure. Sir Divish sent me to find you. And it looks like I arrived just in time. God's truth. I'm Henry of Scalis. My name is Marius Bielek, Master Locator. Sir Divish sent me here to survey the area. Well, the outlaws are out of the way, so we can go and report to him, right? Not just yet. Those bastards caught me as soon as I arrived. And so far, all I've seen is the inside of the tent they tied me up in. I still have a job to do. Although, I won't see much in the dark. I'll have to spend the night. Though I doubt I'll get a wink of sleep after what happened. Are you sure there are no more bandits around? You've nothing to worry about. Unless you're afraid of hares. Hmm. Well, come to me after dawn and we'll look the place over together. I'll explain everything to you. All right. Good night. All right, we're gonna come. We're gonna sleep. That's our, our nourishment's pretty low. We can eat from here. We'll probably eat from both of them. You okay now, pup? 
We might need to put a point in your your thing. There's the good doggy. She got Ooh, fucked up. I wonder if we have a point for Houndmaster. Uh, we do have a combat point and sword. I need to learn a new this uh combo is not the greatest. We need a different combo. Doesn't look like we have a good one to use though. I guess we'll work on. We we'll just buy this one. Keep going with the long sword. I'm not really liking the long sword, honestly. All right, Houndmaster, we don't have a point for it yet. All right, we're stuffed full. Get some sleep. How dare you sleep in someone else's bed? Get lost. Oh, shut the fuck up and let's do this shit. Here I am. My lord, welcome to Pribislavitz. That is to say, welcome back to Pribislavitz after all these years. Well, what's left of it? Not to worry, Marius. I'm glad to be back in my old hamlet. Although, it seems to have aged about as gracefully as I have over the years. I beg to differ, sir. It's quite dilapidated, unlike your good self. But at least it's safe now. Thanks in part to Henry here, who also saved me from a predicament that cost me valuable time. Who knows? If it hadn't been for him, we might not even be talking now. Well, lad. In the end, you managed things in your own way, I see. Just as you said you would. I did my best, sir. And back up my ass kicked is what happened. <laughs> uh... We're just going to say that's not important. I won't bother you with the details, sir. You have more important matters to attend to. Let's get down to the matter in hand, shall we? What state is Pribislavitz in? Sir, in my official capacity as locator, I am gratified to inform you that the hamlet of Pribislavitz may be renewed. And indeed it offers prospects of considerable expansion beyond its former limits. Splendid! Finally some good news for this province. And badly needed, too. So, what have you discovered so far? I want to know all the details. If I may, I would recommend quickly appointing a bailiff to take responsibility for the renewal of the village, its coffers and its citizens. True. Hmm. First things first. Since you understand these matters best, you shall take charge of the land parceling and building works. You'll be available to the bailiff, but answerable directly to me. I'd be honored, sir. Thank you. And, as regards the office of bailiff, what about you, Henry? Yes, sir. You've proven yourself well. You've demonstrated that you're capable of solving problems, and you command the respect of your former Scalit's neighbors. Well, I'm not so sure. And you're also capable of maintaining law and order. I must concur. So... Let us expedite matters. Henry, I hereby appoint you to the office of bailiff of the hamlet of Pribislavitz in my domain. My lord, it's a great honor. Thank you. You will oversee the initial renewal and administration of the village that will set the ground for further development. <laughs> but don't imagine it'll be a bed of roses, lad. Being bailiff doesn't mean you can do whatever you like. If you don't treat the settlers rightly, I'll soon find out and relieve you of your office. Besides, we can't spare a single groschen from the Talmberg coffers now, with the province in chaos. So, you'll have to cover the cost for the building work from your own purse. Well, that's, um... I mean... Are you sure I'm the right man for the job, sir? It's a lot of responsibility. As you said yourself, Henry, it's a great honour. Besides, you won't be alone in it. I'll assist you and supervise the construction work. Phew. All right, then. So, we're agreed. You'll give this document to the Rite Bailiff. He'll make the announcement to invite settlers, which should ensure enough people to begin work. At the same time, 
Your official appointment as bailiff will be announced. I don't know what to say, sir. I'm sure you won't disappoint me, Henry. And now I must get back to my duties at Townburg. Send word when everything is prepared. Certainly, sir. Have a safe journey. Farewell, sir. Okay, so we're getting the town started underway. We get a ride to Rate and have him read that letter out, and then we can start building stuff in uh, Privislavitz here. Uh, I think that's a good spot to end this episode. Uh, next episode, I'll probably do some work off camera, actually. I'll probably ride down there and let him read that note, and then I'm going to probably go hunting and get a bunch of money, or I just might go hunting now and get a bunch of money, and uh, then get the town start starting to get built. So that'd be good. But yeah, we're going to end the episode here. Appreciate you tuning in. If you did tune in the whole time, make sure you hit the like, sub, all that stuff on your way out. Much appreciated. Much love. And we will catch you on the next one later.